So how did it start? Like, give me the beginning. Like, were you like traveling to Australia and saw this plant? Like, yo, <laughs> I feel like this going to be the next detox. So how did it start? No, you know what? It, the way it started is that I got home from Australia. I was playing basketball overseas. I met an herbalist that I really liked, and and um, he told me about his business. I said he told me about his product. I was like, okay, it's interesting. Let me try the product. I tried the product, had an amazing experience. We hired an herbal team, we increased upon the formulas, we started developing the business, and that's when we began to launch. It took us about four years to really master it. So in between then, I had a different, I was working my other businesses, my brother was working the real estate company, and, and the herbalist, he was focusing on the herbal formulas and dealing with the herbal team that way. So, the, so we just, Basically, it took us about four years to really figure everything out, and then, you know, something clicked, and that was it. We never looked back after that. Are you able to share some of that? Because that must be something fundamental. 15 years ago, came up with a plan that you're still using right now. A lot of times, people don't understand terrestrial radio is still a good, viable source to obtain customers. Terrestrial radio. Yeah, so that's just regular radio. Right. You turn on the radio station, you hear it, and and you hear music and you hear talk radio and things like that. So basically my brother came up with an idea to go to those kind of, go to more of a talk show radio that they, and they play music. Mm -hmm. So it's more talk and they play music, right. not they play music and they talk. Right, right, so, right, right. so basically in that kind of a scenario, you have a situation where people believe in the host. They love the host because they like hearing them talk about whatever they're talking about, whether or not it's Steve Harvey, whether or not it's Howard Stern. These have people that love them, that believe them, that trust them. Mm.